What? What are you doing here? I volunteer here on the Wednesdays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I pushed the snack trolley round the wards when old Hilda's off, didn't you know? What do you think I'm doing here, Robert? Rebecca's alive. Yeah, and she's been through something terrible. She's hardly in a state for visitors. You're here, aren't you? Seriously, Ross, now isn't the time. She's confused, she's fragile. Look, me and her, we were good, you know, before she left. Well, I say it left, but what's even happened to her? I don't want to know. Oh, stop doing that, stop speaking for her. She doesn't know I'm here, she might want to see me. Yeah, well, right now, she's wiped out. And if you care about her like I think you're saying you do, then you'll go home, you'll come back in a few days. I mean it, Ross. Give her some space. Just go home. She was where I told you, I swear. We believe you. What? Not because you've got an honest face, obviously. Rebecca backed up your story. So she's okay? Physically. The scars you can't see will take far longer to heal. Only in light of Ms. White's statement, we need to ask you some more questions. Like Mrs. Sykes. We're itching to hear about her. What do you want to know? Anything that could help us discover her whereabouts. And if I tell you, is it going to reduce my sentence? <laughs> He is joking. You're facing a murder charge. Not to mention the ongoing investigation into the deaths of your mother, grandfather and best friend. Basically, you could tell us where Lord looking, the A-team and where's Wally are. We won't stop you going to prison for a very long time. 